Hello everybody, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch, and I said a couple days ago that Humble are going heavily after game developers, and uh, they launched a book one a couple days back about getting into the game development industry, and today they've launched another one that is directly aimed, well at least primarily, at game developers, and that's the Humble Intro to Code Bundle. So what exactly is this one? What do you get? What are the tiers? And is it worth it? Of course, I am here to answer all of those questions, and as always, if it is related to game developers, I buy it so you can see hands-on how this one works. Now, in this particular case, though, it worked a little bit different than all the other prior Humble bundles. Basically, you are buying a code that you then go and redeem on a website. I'll show you the entire process in just a second. But first, let's look at the courses that are being offered. So you head on over. This is the Humble Intro to Code Bundle. Uh, awesome online courses for you. We teamed up with Zenva Academy for our newest bundle. Get access to online courses on game development, web development, computer vision, machine learning, AI, data sciences, and more. Plus, your purchases will support girls uh, who code, code.org, and a charity of your choice. And of course, you also support me if you buy it through my link, which by the way, thank you. So what do you get in this bundle? Well, at the dollar tier, you get learn Python program by making a game, intro to game development, numpy matrices and vectors, learn HTML and CSS uh, by creating a responsive company website, and complete responsive web design course. Now, as I said, this is targeting game developers pretty heavily, and you're going to see that in a second. So if you pay more than the average of $12.84, very strange average this time, uh, VR projects, flying and platform experiences unlocked, create a road crossing game with Phaser 3, create a Spanish teaching game with Phaser 3, learn Angular by creating a web application, Blender for beginners, uh, craft low level, um, sorry, craft low poly game assets, uh, create your first 3D game, I believe this is Unity, uh, JavaScript programming, learn by making a mobile game, and beginning SQL, store and query your data. And then finally, at the top tier, and by the way, if you're not familiar with how Humble Bundles work, if you buy the top tier, you get all of the tiers below it. So if I buy this tier, I get these ones and these ones as well. Um, so here we see uh, procedural content generation with Unity, VR Projects 360 photo experience, uh, building a virtual pet game with Phaser 3, Python image processing, uh, make Instagram style filters, create a Raspberry Pi smart security camera, complete artificial neural network course, RPG game development, turn-based battle systems, uh, audio effects and soundtracks in Unity games, data manipulation with pandas, um, the complete guide to bootstrap for discover jQuery, create interactive websites and create an NPC and sorry, an RPG town with NPCs and dialogue. So you're seeing, we're predominantly seeing, uh, phaser three, uh, unity courses. And I believe there, again, there was that one course on Python programming by making a game. So this is primarily, um, unity or phaser three courses that you're seeing here. Uh, so what exactly do you get here? Well, I'm gonna to have to be a little careful about showing you exactly how this works. Uh, here is the registration and sign it process. So basically when you buy it at whatever tier, you get a code on the Humble Bundle website. You then basically click the link that they provide, which sends you over to a store page on um, the uh, Zenva site. And then at that point in time, you basically do a checkout of whatever tier it's staying there. So mine was tier three. And then you put the code in, the price goes to zero and you purchase. Unfortunately, you do need to register with Zena to be able to use this promo or to use this courseware at all. Uh, I just use Google authentication personally. It only took, um, the only requirement it had was to be able to see my email address. So uh, authorizing was no problem at all. Once your code is there, uh, you head on back over to the Zenva Academy website. Your courses are available at my courses. And you'll see here. Now, one of the things I'm finding mildly annoying is they keep trying to sell me stuff at discounts while I'm going through this. So I got a couple of offers already. I really wish they hadn't done that on this side of things. Now, sure, during checkout, yeah. But when I come back and checking my course out, please don't try and sell me stuff, even if it is a good deal. So then what you see here is you come down here, it shows you your most recent course that you checked out and you can look at the courses that are available. I'm gonna go through one of these in particular. If you do have questions about the specific courses in here, do let me know and I will make a point of learning a little bit more about it. Obviously, I don't have the time to run through these courses. And frankly, I am not really the target demographic. These are a little bit um, 
I'm a little bit beyond these kind of course materials for my use. So really, I've just purchased this to illustrate to you guys what you would be getting. So I'm going to pick one. Um, a lot of times there's a lot of interest in these RPG things. So let's pick one of those as an example. I haven't seen it yet, so I've got no idea what's there. So there's the, oh yeah, there's also that Blender course. So there's four different topics of develop, it's to game developers. Uh, where is RPG? Let me just go ahead. RPG, RPG game development, turn-based battle system. I'm also kind of curious what this is actually uh, made for. So when you go into this stuff, and I have to be a little careful here because obviously this material is copywritten, so I can't really show you much of the course itself, uh, but I can show you the structure of it. I'm not going to bother with the introduction, but we'll go to an actual lesson. So here I want to learn about spells. I click spells. The video itself comes up. Make sure that I'm muted and not capturing that. So it is loading. For some reason, it's transferring data from Facebook, which I was not expecting to see. And I actually did find in my previous uh, run through this too, I had it kind of hang on me for a bit. So the loading can be a little slow. All right, so obviously this is a Unity project. It comes through. It is a typical video tutorial, um, much like I provide. Now there is some areas of this where this is quite cool though. So in addition to the step-by-step -step instruction you're gonna see going through here, so we're gonna go to the end. I don't like the size of this video player. The nice thing is you can maximize it like this and exit out. So it's not really a big deal, but what's cool is you've actually got lesson notes and curriculum right here. So curriculum, I believe was the course where we were at before. But if I go to lesson notes, we actually see step-by-step -step written instruction that goes along with what you're actually seeing there. So in, in some ways, this is actually a lot like what I actually provide, where I will link to the source code on dev game or game from scratch. Well, they have it in the same form, but it is in the format of, um, these course notes that you see attached to each lesson. So as you're watching a video, if you want to check out the code or whatever, you hit the courseware and then it's got kind of the same step by step. All of the code you are working on is available here. Um, so yeah, that's that's actually pretty nice. Like, so if you're a visual learner and you want to just read about it, uh, you do have the option. Now I do wish there was the ability and there might be, so don't don't take this the wrong way, but I wish I could also develop the lesson notes as a PDF, as a single link PDF. And I don't see any way to do that as of yet. Now, the other cool thing about this, and let me see if I can find it here. So I'll go back to the course home. Um, you also have course files. So in this particular case, I'll go ahead and download that guy. It's always a zip archive. And these are all the various different files that are part of the course. So go in here, you're gonna see um, assets and projects like so these are your, your project files and, and the assets being used in the course so everything you need is in turn provided as part of the course um now the only thing i really can't give you as of yet is again a good judgment on the quality of these tutorials but the presentation is quite good um even if you're kind of on the fence about this the one dollar tier gets you if you're just looking to learn math or introduction to game development or Python for a buck. You can go in here, try one out and see if it works for you. See if you like their style. Now, one of the nice things about this, and this is going to be me dumping on Udemy. Udemy doesn't have quality control. Basically they are uh, outsourcing tutorial development to a number of different people. In this particular case, Zenva is creating and authoring all of their own content. So this is a company that that is making a uh, commercialized game development tutorial. In some ways, they're kind of doing some of what I do uh, just with a bigger team and selling it. And you know what? It, it might be a good combination. So that is yet another game developer oriented um, humble bundle. Uh, like I said, I, I keep getting more and more and more of these humble bundles that are just kind of adding up. Humble bundle is my new Steam. Uh, there's just more and more stuff I'm buying and probably never ever revisiting again, but I still feel pretty good about it. 25 bucks, some of it goes to charity and I have even more stuff in my, my pile of stuff, stuff pile which makes absolutely no sense, but I hope you understand where I'm coming from. So anyways, that is the introduction to code uh, bundle. This really should have been called a game dev bundle because the I would say 65 to 70% of the content is Unity, Phaser, Blender, or Python for game development. And then there's a few other web things thrown in there, uh, but it's, it's an interesting bundle. Obviously it's, it's only gonna be useful to you if, if any of those topics are something you wanna learn more about. And of course you are competing with like, for example, I do courses on, I'm going to be doing a tutorial on Phaser 3 upcoming. So do you need more than one? And do you want to pay for it? But then again, having it all in one place, 
for only 25 bucks, that's again, that's like the cost of a book. So uh, it is nice the way they've structured this. It's nice that you get all of the content. There's also some uh, commenting options so you can communicate with other people that have gone through the course beforehand. Uh, but I do really like the, um, the fact that you can drill down and get a text-based version to go along with each particular video. Their, their setup and structure here is actually very much quite nice. And they're saying that the top tier, when you first purchase it, it comes out at something like $1,100 if you're going to buy everything all together. Yeah, $1,348. So, um, yeah, that's it. Uh, let me know what you think. Uh, does this courseware, does their structure look interesting to you? Or more importantly, have you used their courses before? Do you have experience with Zenva? And if so, how quality did you actually find the courses? So far, I just kind of looked at the structure of how the courses are structured and I'm impressed that way, but I couldn't really tell you as of yet just how good their instruction actually is. So if you do have experience with their courses in the past, I would love to hear about them down below and I'm sure everyone else would as well. All right, that's it for now. Um, I'm assuming that that's gonna be it for Humble Bundles for a little bit and they, they just can't run too, too many. And also on that note, I will link the other ongoing Humble Bundle down as well in case you missed out on that. There's a big one about game industry books for sale right now as well too. All right, that is it. Talk to you all later. Goodbye.